has a very special meaning for me. Uh, I still remember the very first time that I went to the movies. I was like 13 years old. I'm 38, so that was like a long time ago. And I went with my dad, who actually passed away. So I do remember, you know, it does have a, sure. a special meaning, that daughter, yes. that moment. Yes. So sure. I can't wait for this movie to be out. <laughs> That's so nice to hear. Do you remember the first time you actually saw this film? You know, I was I was older. I had already started being an actor, um, and so the the notion. And I was so busy trying to figure out my way in the world, uh, and the fact that an animated new animated Disney movie cut through, and hearing that music and 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 what a wonderful story it was that that it was relevant to me, because usually you remember the ones you grow up with the most. But this one this one was this one was for all audiences for all ages, and, and there was something really special about that moment. Back then, have you ever fantasized that you were going to end up directing this no, film? No, Not even, never. right? No. Who ever thought they would even make another one? Right. And you know, what was your favorite character? Was well, I like I like Timon and Pumbaa. That back then. Now I like. Now I'm older. I like Mufasa the most. <laughs> Things change. Things uh, change. What was the biggest challenge while making this movie, and how? Well, are the you... biggest challenge is people like you who grew up with it, who it means so much emotionally to it. You know, and, and there's a lot of, especially kids who grew up. It's. The the original movie is has intense moments and it it, it, it it you're faced with certain harsh realities of, of life, of loss and moving on and, and so that means that there's a bunch of people who grew up with this who connect emotionally tremendously with the original and feel very protective of the original, understandably. I was wondering yesterday at the conference you said that you just finished the movie. Yes. So I wonder who has seen the movie. Because we haven't seen it. No. We just um, see like a little bit of it. You know, nobody who hasn't worked on it has seen it yet. What was your reaction when you saw it? Well, Did you, you cry know, a lot? It, it's I cry all the time with you know, <laughs> I didn't realize when I took the job how much because those scenes it's not like those scenes you get used to them it's heavy and sometimes you're it's different things make you cry oftentimes it's how moving and happy it is I cry the most at the scenes when they're when the father and son are together I was working with this giant uh, huge stars like Beyonce and, and and Glover and Seth Rogens so I think that what's nice about everybody working on this is that they see Lion King mm -hmm. as the star and everybody wants to be a part of supporting the, the story. That, that's really the star of the show. And, and, and this goes for everybody. And, and, and they all say this to me. And they want to make sure they're serving that properly. From playing second roles uh, to presenting scripts that were not accepted, now being responsible for these huge, incredible, successful movies, I wonder what do you see when you look back? Those days in Chicago when you first got there. <laughs> I, I was just I was just back there for an event. It is very surreal and odd. Um, I think what it I think you don't really dwell on those things. And and I always heard people say this. I never really believe them. But um, it all feels the same. It's it's the things that really endure are the relationships that you have, whether it's with um, people in your family, your children, your wife, fa parents, uh, the people you work with. And then outside of that, there's this wonderful other thing that I get to have, which is all the things that I've worked on, there are people who have grown up with that, who've seen it, who've heard it. And so I feel like when I meet new people, it's like meeting friends that I didn't know I had. That's the most special aspect of it that I didn't anticipate when I started. That's going to happen to you when you go to Argentina, because we love yes, you there, and yes. we can't wait for you to visit us and then cook us. I would love to, and eat. <laughs> I'll Please. do more eating than cooking. Yes, you're going to really enjoy it. Anytime I see them cooking in Argentina, it makes, uh -huh. me, makes my mouth water. And we have an amazing see. chef actually there in Argentina. Yes. Lovely meeting you. Can't wait for this movie to be out. Thank, Thank you. you so much. It was a wonderful conversation.